This is one of history's biggest cannons, but how useful was it actually? So this is Mons Meg, an enormous 15th century cannon that was gifted to King James II of Scotland for his wedding. Granted, it did arrive eight years late, but you know who's counting, because I mean, that is one big cannon. Now, this baby could shoot cannonballs that weighed about 330 pounds, which is around three of me. These missiles would then be launched for over two miles from this impressive 20 inch barrel, which is just enough room for a small adult to fit in. So we get it, this cannon was big, but how useful was it actually? Well, not massively. See, the sheer size of the cannon meant that even a well-trained team of oxen could only move it for about three miles a day, meaning that this thing wasn't necessarily the most dynamic weapon at the king's disposal. As such, it quite quickly took up a new role as a largely ceremonial gun being fired to mark special occasions. But this too came to an end in 1680, when the cannon was fired to celebrate the arrival of James II. No, not that one. Yeah, that's the guy, thank you. See, when the cannon was shot, the barrel burst, bringing an end to Mons Meg's cannon career. But you can still see it today at Edinburgh Castle.